Curcumin is a polyphenol found in the plant turmeric, which is commonly used as a spice, known for its anti-inflammatory properties, which curcumin gives it. And after being extracted from turmeric, curcumin has been found to have a ton of antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties, which allow it all of its positive benefits seen in the studies. One study, for instance, looked at those who have a consistent intake of curcumin-heavy curry, and they found that those individuals had a 39% lower risk of death from all causes and a 1.0 year increase in life expectancy. And while there are no human studies looking directly at curcumin supplementation for all-cause mortality or life expectancy, there are a bunch of studies on curcumin supplementation for markers of longevity and markers of performance. For instance, in regards to cardiovascular disease markers, curcumin has been shown to decrease hemoglobin A1c by about 0.7%. It's also been shown to decrease LDL by about 5.84% and decreased triglycerides by 13.15. Curcumin has also been shown, again, through these anti-inflammatory antioxidant effects to decrease BMI and decrease body weight by an average of 1.14 kilograms. And then on the performance side of things, curcumin has been shown to improve cognition in healthy, young individuals, all the way up to individuals struggling with neurodegenerative diseases. It's also been shown to decrease joint pain in athletes, as well as older individuals with osteoarthritis, due to, again, those anti-inflammatory properties, and it's been shown to reduce markers of muscle soreness and fatigue and improve athletic performance as well. So this is truly an amazing tier two supplement for longevity and performance. But what form of curcumin should you be taking? Well, curcumin is tricky because it's very, very poorly absorbed on its own. So it's important to find a form that is highly studied to be highly bioavailable and contain known amounts of curcumin. So to me, the three forms that do that are Mariva, which is also known as curcumin phytosome, essentially curcumin wrapped up in phospholipids, which makes it 29 times higher absorbed than a standard curcumin. The second is theracumin, which is also known as nanocurcumin, meaning that it has very, very small particles, which allow it to be better absorbed this way. And studies show that it is absorbed 27 times higher than standard curcumin. And finally is Longvita, which is curcumin wrapped in a lipid matrix, which also allows it to be very highly absorbed, up to 65 times higher than the standard curcumin. Of these three forms, Mariva is easily the highest studied for curcumin's number one effect of joint pain. It's also the number one studied for metabolic benefits and just overall systemic inflammation. So for that reason, I'm going with Mariva here for my overall longevity and performance choice. However, Longvita has a bunch of studies on it for improving cognition that are probably even more promising than Mariva. However, just not enough studies yet on the other benefits. So Longvita, definitely not a wrong choice and more studies could prove eventually that it might even be better than Mariva. Dosing is much more standard here. For Mariva, all the studies really use one gram per day, which is essentially 200 milligrams of curcuminoids. And for Longvita, it's a little bit more variable. However, most studies do use 80 milligrams of curcuminoids or 400 milligrams of long vita. Timing wise, it's definitely beneficial to take curcumin with a meal because it's fat soluble. So the fat in the meal will help it be absorbed better. However, this probably matters less if you're using Mariva or long vita due to their high bioavailability. Optimally, you would split your dose up to two times per day. This is because curcumin has a very short half-life. So if you take it two times per day, you're going to have more steady levels throughout the day to allow for lower systemic inflammation and all those positive benefits. And ideally, you'd take one of those doses prior to your workout, similar to collagen, so you can have the best performance-enhancing effects of your curcumin. And finally, on brands. For Mariva, if you're going that route like I am, I'm using Thorns Curcumin Phytosome. It's a great, super high quality product. It's NSF certified, which is the highest bar for testing. And it has 500 milligram capsules of Mariva, so you can split it up to two times per day, which I love. However, if you wanna go the long Vita route, the best high quality tested, yet also cost-effective version that I found was Nootropics Depot. They have great 400 milligram tablets of long Vita if you're looking for more of that cognitive effect.